welcome this is the Halloween reading for um, the hurt sign people this is a reading for 21 days after the 1st of October as of the 1st of October and um, this is a magical period as you will manifest um, this is the time to manifest okay so you earth signs um, what is coming in for you earth signs is that the energy of the world is here to help you earth signs so it's as if the universal angels and guides uh, that this is a period for the Capricorn to manifest so for the people who are in the fifth dimension 21 days after um, between the the first the 31st of October and 21 days after that it's going to be a good time to manifest but for the hurt signs because you guys are hurt signs you are the Taurus Virgo and Capricorn this period is um, going to be helping you guys to manifest things okay so whatever is going on so um, the universal angels and guides are here um, Archangel Anuel, the mystical angels are coming in to give the message for the earth signs. Um, if you would like um, a video to know how to manifest in this time span, remember these videos are timeless, so this message is timeless. Um, this message is 21 days message, so what that means is that from now until the 31st of March, it is time to manifest, okay? So for the earth sign people, so let's see what is coming up for you guys, okay? So um, um, I'm not doing any extended reading. You have to ask for your personal reading. We have the five of candles. The five of candles is conflicts. So you earth signs are going to be having conflicts. Um, this manifest this manifestation time, this is um, for the Halloween reading. You're coming in with conflicts, okay? So um, some of you will have conflicts. Some of you won't have conflicts. It depends on who you are and how is this existing for you. I'm seeing this energy that is coming up. It has to do with work, whatever the situation is that it has to do with work and projects. So I'm seeing conflicts over um, at work and with your project. It's coming up for... Um, People who are dealing with work and project, there are conflicts, okay? Then we have the five of tombs. The five of tombs is money, and this has to do with work. So some of you, um, the, the, the project, what you're working on, there is transition. Transition um, with projects that you're working on. So this is definitely affecting people on the work floor. This is the energy of um, things affecting people on the work floor, people who have their own business, okay? Now, what we have here is the Dreamer of Bells. The Dreamer of Bells is uh, um, a woman um, that is an uh, Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra. This is a woman that is Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra. Whoever this woman is and however, it can be a woman or a man that is coming up. Um, this person is in the reverse. I'm seeing the six of tombs that some help is definitely going to be coming in for um, you people. So you earth sign people, some help is definitely going to be coming up. Um, and this help is coming in. Um, a Taurus could be helping you. Um, you Tauruses could be helping the rest of the hurt sign people. I'm seeing a situation with the Taurus and the Capricorns that is going to be helping out the rest of you hurt sign people. And this is good. Okay. What we have here, um, we have the, um, the creators of bells. The creator of bells is someone between the ages of 18 and 45. That is an Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra. This person is in the reverse. Okay, so this person is not being vibrating on a, a, a good energy vibration. They are in the reverse. Okay, so we have the Ace of Wands. This is good. This is wonderful. This is in the center. So I'm seeing new beginnings that is coming up because of whoever that was being very deceptive. I'm thinking this is going to be coming out. So some of you are dealing with a young person 
that is an Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra. They're in the reverse, so you are going to be having a new start. Then we have uh, the energy of the numerous. This is uh, the Empress, and I'm um, seeing help is going to be coming in for your financial stability, and this is going to be good. So whatever materialistic, uh, um, you can manifest materialistic wealth in this time for you earth sign people. Then we have the four of vase, whatever the issue is that you had with a young Aquarian, Gemini or Libra, you're no longer regretting this. You stood up for um, the injustice and equality and that is really, really good. The eight of bells, you're seeing the truth of what has transpired. So some of you are going to be finding out something about this young Aquarian, Gemini or Libra. You're seeing the truth of what has transpired, okay? But you're going to be having a new start because you saw the truth of what has transpired. Um, the Ace of Tomb is here, so a new start is coming up to your financial situation. Whatever is transpiring and happening for you, hurt sign people, your financial situation, I'm seeing a new start. Coming out is right beside the Empress. The Empress is a Capricorn person that is going to be helping the rest of you, hurt sign people, to have financial abundance. I'm seeing transition is coming up. I'm seeing the end to um, a Cancer, whoever this Cancer is. It is a young Cancer. I'm seeing the end to this Cancer because they have found out Whatever this cancer has done, they have found it out or um, you had shed a light and they have found out what this young cancer have done. I've seen the visionaire. The visionaire is the energy of a Taurus and the energy of an organization that is coming in. There's a transition because they found out what a young person that is an Aquarius, Gemini of Libra has done. I'm seeing also um, a Gemini also having some worries dealing with some situation because they found out what exactly has transpired. This Gemini could have been in a relationship with a Cancer and a Scorpion could um, tell the truth of whatever has happened and transpired. So a Scorpion is going to be seeing the truth. I'm seeing money coming into you. So money, you end the this mystical period where the money is coming in. This is wonderful and this is good for you earth sign people. It is going to be a very promising um, a manifestation, a manifestation period for this Halloween. Um, remember that this reading is timeless and um, it has the energy of uh, the mystical time is between the 31st of October and the 31st of January. But some of you will have it also till the 31st of March. So you can um, manifest from the 31st of October till the 31st of March. Okay, so this is good and this is wonderful. This is very good and this is wonderful. It's a beautiful spread for you earth sign people. I am I'm sorry, but I don't have the time to do the extended for you guys. Okay, I know a lot of people are going to be asking for extended, but it is uh, a call a, a short time is that someone asked me to do uh, and let people know um about this magical period because 2020 is coming right up and for you earth sign people. Um, 2020 is going to bring you guys a lot of positive vibration, a lot of positive vibration, okay? What is transpiring is that some of you are going to be receiving your wishes and dreams. So whatever that was happening and transpired, some of you are definitely going to be receiving your wishes and dreams coming true um, throughout the period of 31st of October 2019 until the 31st of March 2020. So as we look at this, I'm seeing that some of you are dealing with some air sign. Um, female, they can be female or a man. That is coming up. These are Aquarian, Geminis, and Librans. Before I go any forward or any further, the number five energy. Okay. Um, number five is always about transition. It's all about always about changes okay number five energies is about transition it's always about changes now the most beautiful thing that is transpiring is that there is going to be some new start that is coming up and um 
as your earth sign manifests, uh, the new start are definitely going to be here because there is the energy of transition that is coming up. So number nine is um, you guys have the energy of, uh, and this is really beautiful and wonderful because different situations are coming up is the number five. You have the number five energies that you can use to manifest a lot of things. You guys are dealing with a, a lot of hurt sign people, a lot of air sign people. It's all about um, the financial stability because we have the six of toon. Uh, okay, and this is the energy of uh, um, help, receiving help um, to manifest what it is that you want. Um, the um, Capricorns are going to be helping out because the Capricorns are up in this time and the Capricorns are very spiritual people. So they are helping with to manifest for you earth sign people, the Taurus and the Virgos. Now, what is transpiring, if you notice, the Empress is up in this reading and the Empress is being connected with money. It's as if the Empress is going to be making sure that financial abundance, you see the Ace of Pentacles, the Nine of Pentacles and the Six of Pentacles where help is going to be coming in to manifest um, money in your life. And this is going to be good in this period this is the all of rain reading. So please remember, this is the all of rain reading. Now, the major arcanist that comes up and they are going to be helping you guys to manifest. It is the energy of transition. So some of you come in and was dealing with the dreamer of the bell. Now, the dreamer of the bell is, um, it can be male or female, four to five years and older. And there is definitely going to be a transition that is coming up for this person, whoever this person is and whatever this person has done. There is a transition. It's as if this person will be transit out of your life. So the energy of the bell is an Aquarian, Gemini or Libra. The energy of transition is that this major or corner is coming in to make um, shift of energies um, in your world. Then we have um, the organization. So obviously an organization, if some of you have some injustice, an organization is going to be seen what exactly has transpired. So we're going to be looking for the crystal and find out um, what is transpired where um, some of you were dealing with uh, um, hardship, financial hardship when it comes on to your business, but I'm seeing a new start is coming up. Some of you could have a hardship on the work floor, but I'm seeing a new start is coming in. So some of you, if you have your own business, there could have been some financial hardship with your business, but I'm seeing this is going to be resolved and I'm seeing you're going to be receiving some help, whether on the work floor or whether with your business, you're going to be receiving some help. What I'm also seeing is that some of you are dealing with an Aquarius, Gemini or Libra, and um, help is going to be coming in because I'm seeing that it could be a legal issue that a young Aquarius, Gemini or Libra has done some injustice and organization is going to be seeing that it's going to be the end. I'm seeing conflicts that you're having conflicts with a young person that is a, an Aries Leo or Sagittarius. Um, it, there is conflicts, but I'm seeing that um, the energy of uh, um, this is... Uh, um, a major or a corner. this is a mother figure or um, this person could be coming up to nurturing you and to help you through because there is conflicts about your materialistic stability and it has to do with a young Aries Leo or Sagittarius who has done something um, against you to um, create this sort of energy. Okay, so whoever this person situation is, I'm seeing it coming to an end. You are coming out with energy of the world okay so you're ending a situation um it could be an on um an unjust a situation an on a situation you're finishing this up as we look i'm seeing a new start coming in there was some regrets but i'm seeing a new start coming in with an organization there was really some regrets that has happened and transpired i'm seeing that an organization could have to pay you a lot of money some of you or you could be start your business could be picking up and money a new start to your financial stability. 
whoever and um whoever this person is this person whoever that young person is that is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius I think this person is going to be either caught and dealt with very very um hard because they're going to find out that this person has stolen a lot of money so whatever and whoever that person is but the money is going to return to you okay the money is going to return to you because you found out the truth of what has happened and transpired so some of you it could be your child or it could be a younger person it could be that someone who works for you have been stealing for you whatever that has been um transpiring um with this with this energy of the Halloween season where it's a magical season it doesn't you don't really have to celebrate Halloween it's all about a magical um occurrences and a magical season that is coming up what you're going to be realizing is this after this magical season is that your angels and guides underneath and behind the veils is going to be helping you to give you a new start so March 21st some of you are going to be realizing that whatever you start manifesting from October 31st it is going to be happening for you March 31st you're going to be seeing this so transition is coming up I'm seeing the Empress um, is coming up to bring this transition now the Empress is a mother figure the Empress is someone who protects your financial stability the Empress helps you give you idea give you new ideas to move on and be very powerful moving through and helping and realizing what is happening in the beginning I was um um, doing your cards and I'm seeing that you're going to be having a new story so this new story comes up where the ace of wands which is a new start so it's going to be um situations is ending in your life um whatever the situations is it's ending in your life and you're definitely going to be receiving a new start okay so some of you could have been dealing with some issues situations in your life and this is really ending and a new start is coming up you have the energy of the world that is centered where um these new start is uh, um coming up so whatever the worries was whatever you were seeing clearly i'm seeing them um um, um it's as if they're becoming elevated and you're seeing you're seeing definitely what they're doing and what has been um transpiring you're seeing that definitely coming out but what was happening behind the, the veils when you weren't aware of what is happening so in the week um let's say from the 31st 21 days later or for some of you can get it 21 days after that or some of you can get it 21 days after that it depends on who you are and if your vibration in the fifth if you're vibrating in a fifth dimension then you are going to be seeing um these issues and situations res um resolution coming up for it okay alrighty so let's trans let's see what is happening um for the earth sign people because i'm seeing some conflicts some of you are having uh, some conflicts with a leo whoever this leo is i'm seeing um you're going to be winning this conflicts this leo has tried to take over something for you there is going to be a decision where you're standing up for injustice and equality for a deceptive move i'm seeing you making your mark and standing up for injustice and equality now some of you are dealing with um a Pisces cancer or scorpion whoever this person is she and an Aquarius Gemini or Libra 45 years and older have done something that is going to be coming out I'm seeing the truth is going to be coming out to whatever they have done I'm seeing that you're going to be receiving help dealing with this person definitely I said it the truth is going to be coming out about a Pisces cancer or a scorpion woman it doesn't really matter how this person affects you whether it's a family whether it's friend whoever this person is the truth is coming out um, what um, this person have done so number two energies is coming up for you guys money is going to be coming in um the nine of pentacles money is definitely going to be coming in i am seeing that some money that was stolen from you is going to be returning to you okay so, so there was some deceptiveness of money so the nine um uh, money is going to be coming in there was a young person that was an aries leo or sagittarius have worked together with a pisces cancer or a scorpion and I'm seeing that um, whatever the issue and the situation is, you're going to be receiving help. 
and by receiving help what is transpiring is that the truth about these people are going to be coming out the truth about these people are going to be coming out there is a judgment call that is coming up. A judgment call is coming up on um, these people, whatever they have done. So I'm seeing the truth coming out about an, an Aries Leo and a Sagittarius and a, a, a lady that is a Pisces, Cancer or a Scorpion. Um, the truth is going to be coming out. The energy of the three of ones is that some of you are um, looking forward to leave a situation with an Aries Lee or Sagittarius, this is a young person, whoever this young person is, they have been caught. They have been caught doing something, whatever they have done, whatever has transpired, they have been caught doing something. And you are going to be getting this new start because it's as if it could be a situation at work, whatever they have done and whatever has transpired, it's all coming out about this young person. I'm seeing that you don't really regret. You have a very, very strong foundation. I'm seeing money coming in if you decided to buy a house or apply for a mortgage or um, anything to do with real estate, business, um, office space. This is going to be good. You will receive the assistant to start whatever you want to start. This is going to be good. Transition is going to be coming in because I'm seeing an offer. Um, this offer that is coming in, um, some of you could be looking for a new job. Yes, you're going to be receiving it. Some of you could be looking for a new job. Yes, you are going to be receiving it because I'm seeing people is going to be helping you to get back on your foot. Okay. Or um, if you were looking for a new job, um, it is the time um, after the 20th of November to sign new contracts. Before that, don't do it. I'm seeing someone, a young person that is a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion, is coming in and offering you love, offering an apology, and offering you love, and wants a new start. So whoever this person is, is a Taurus, Virgo, or is a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion, this person is coming in and offering you love. It doesn't really have to be a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion. It can be someone new, a new love is coming in. This person... um is offering you and uh, is asking for a new start okay so it's as if there could have been someone who you were seeing there was some um, imbalance with the relationship whatever has transpired I'm seeing um, it's as if this period is bringing back this person and this person realized that um, who you are and I'm seeing this person asking for a new start because there's definitely a new start They're they're offering you love but they also wants to have a new start with you so um whoever is coming in it is going to be okay i'm seeing you celebrating the three of cups i'm seeing you celebrating this could be a cancer who is offering an apology to you for some of you a cancer could be coming in and uh, offering an apology to you or a cancer could be of coming in and of um offering you a new um of start okay so it could be in love but uh it could be in love but it is not really in love it is whoever this um this um cancer is um this cancer could be coming in for some of you offering um asking for a new start okay so this cancer could be coming in and this cancer is someone who is really financial stable so if you were looking for this rich guy this cancer has it um i have static um this cancer have it and um i'm seeing you're going to be celebrating coming over a situation i'm seeing if it's a divorce, a cancer is going to be giving you what you want. If it's a divorce, some of you, um, I'm seeing an ex who is a cancer could be coming back because they want to be in a relationship with you. So, um, oh my God, whoever this person is, is really coming back because they want to be in a relationship with you. So, um, this is going to be good. This is going to be positive. So do not be, um, you know, aware or offline. This is going to be positive. So I'm seeing offer of work, new start. Um, as a scorpion could be coming back in your life once a new start. Um, I'm seeing that they're going to be finding out something about a young Aries Lee or Sagittarius. It could be your child, but I'm seeing that this person, uh, you know, it's not really 
showing where this person and what is happening but i'm seeing that news is coming in for a new start i'm seeing a pisces cancer or a scorpion wants to reconnect with you this um this person is coming up as a mother figure okay because i'm seeing that this person realized what has transpired and this person is going to be offering you a lot of money so i'm seeing money coming in um and you start to your money is coming in from an issue with the organization so it could be a payout of an insurance uh, um it could be the payout of an insurance uh, um it could be the payout of money that you weren't aware of that was there for you it could be somebody had stolen this money and they have found out what has transpired and this money is going to be returned to you but i'm saying here you're going to be successful um successfully receiving back this money so it, it, it could have been that um money was paid out to you or was sent off to you but somebody has intercept this money and they are going to be finding out that someone has intercept this money and this person is going to be seeing some jail time because they're definitely going to be finding out that someone had intercept the money and they're going to be finding out that so um, whatever that was transpiring with some of you and some money, it could be an organization because I'm seeing this organization coming up and they're going to be offering you an apology. Um, so it could be, and for some of you, what is going to be transpiring is that whatever is transpiring, an organization is coming up and is offering some of you an apology. So it could be an organization that realized that people had used your name or information or your bank account or your credit card or something like that, that extra was charged or people had took your money that has nothing to do or some overcharge or something, but they are going to be finding out that either someone else had make an, an, uh, another account that your money was going in that account and they were using a bank pass to access your account. So there is something that is going on, but it's all going to come out and all, all the people that is involved and who made that bank account and all the people that was involved is going to go and see jail time. Okay. Someone keep on saying to me, why are you always talking about jail time? It's because it's coming up in the reading and um, I'm not seeing that they are going to just let off the hook. I'm seeing that they're getting jail time. It's as if the universe is um is really um dealing with them. So I'm seeing a Pisces cancer or a scorpion woman have to pay a lot of you some money. I'm seeing an apology coming towards you and an offer of love coming towards you. I'm seeing you have a strong foundation with a house situation if you're looking for a house sorry a new house or a um office space a new house or a new apartment or office space whatever that you're trying to manifest it's going to happen for you guys so start manifesting from the 31st and it's always uh, it depends on what it is that you want to manifest um your angels and guides will guide you to whatever candles you should use for these manifestation then i'm seeing the truth is going to be coming out about an um an older aquarius gemini or libra the truth is going to be coming out i'm seeing a, you have made a decision um with a conflicts you made a decision with a conflicts whatever it is whatever that was transpiring i'm seeing you making a decision with an a conflicts okay so m manifesting money or materialistic uh, um a property and that sort of a thing is going to be very very positive for you guys in this um magical um time that is coming up for you guys so it is a, just a very very promising your wishes and dreams are going to be coming out so i'm seeing that the manifestation for you guys if you're manifesting a new apartment new house um manifesting money clients and that sort of a thing is definitely going to be coming out whatever emotional issues that you have that you were carrying around you're just going to be leaving these behind and this is good so whatever emotional issues that you are carrying around you're going to be leaving this on i'm seeing love coming in i'm seeing apologies apologies is coming in um 
I'm, this is the energy of apologists coming in and I'm seeing the exes returning. Okay. The exes are returning. Apologies are coming in. People wants to have new start with you because they have realized what exactly has transpired. So I'm seeing the exes. Definitely, um, you are going to be celebrating and you, um, her signs are going to be celebrating. Who are going to be celebrating? The Virgos and the Capricorns. The Virgos and the Capricorns are really going to be celebrating whatever issues the Taurus were having. I'm seeing the Taurus helping the rest of the earth signs, uh, um, to, to release a certain energy that was happening and transpiring. I'm seeing you Tauruses. I'm seeing a new start, especially your financial situation. When it comes on to your business, your business is going to be picking up and taking off. Whatever is transpiring, your business is going to be picking up and taking off. So this is really, really a good positive alignment of energies that is coming in. So that is going to be good. I'm seeing a new start. I'm seeing a situation with a house. You're going to be successfully coming over a situation with a house. I'm seeing people seeing the truth of a situation with a young Aries Leo or Sagittarius. And you're going to be receiving a new start because you're walking away from this situation. I'm seeing an apologist is coming in and you stand strong with whatever that is transpiring. Some of you are dealing with um, a woman, a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion. She has to pay you a lot of money. I'm seeing you taking this money and moving forward. I'm seeing some judgment call that is going to be coming out and you make a decision. I no longer want to deal with you and you're going to be moving forward. Some of you are dealing with an Aries and I'm seeing an apologist is coming um, to you from this Aries. I see this Aries want to reconnect with you. Um, it is an Aries, yes. Um, and what is transpiring is that I'm seeing an offer of love is coming. So an ex is coming back from the past, offering you something because I think they realize um, something. They realize also that you're going to be having a lot of money and receiving a lot of money. So I'm seeing this young person is coming back apologizing you to you because they realize that you have overcome a situation. Some of you who are dealing with a scorpion have a, um, a strong foundation. I'm seeing some information is going to be coming out about a house, but you're going to be receiving a lot of money. I'm seeing a lot of money being offered to you and an apology for something that has transpired. And I'm seeing you're going to be receiving a new start moving forward. I'm seeing this energy of uh, you celebrating um coming out of an issue and a situation and you're going to be um moving forward okay ladies and gentlemen um please use these energies this is the mystical energies for the halloween and i want to say i love you guys so much please leave a message below and i will speak to you um soon namaste